Hi guys, Adam here, representing Narva Australia. Today's topic is positive or negatively switching. What we need to understand before we get into this is that for an electrical component to work, we actually need to complete a circuit. Now that circuit can be turned on or off from the positive or from the negative. So we're either going to have a positive switching or we're going to have a negative switching circuit. That affects the way the, the wiring is, is done on the electrical component. And what I want to show you is an example of how we actually test it. So if you have a look at what I've got set up here, I've got my multimeter in voltage scale. I've found the wire that I need for my, for my trigger wire for my vehicle and the positive probe is in that. My negative probe is sitting on the negative battery terminal. Now if this was a negatively switched circuit, what we would actually have is a constant 12 volts at that. So my voltage scale now would be reading battery voltage. As it's not, it's most likely going to be a positive, uh, positive switching circuit. I'm just going to come back here and I'm going to operate my high beams and you'll see that the scale will actually move. If you just have a look here, see how now I've got battery voltage at the scale. So that is showing me that I actually have a positively switched circuit. Guys, just remember if there's anything that you want to see moving forwards, please leave a comment below. Otherwise, I'll see you next time.